everyone, and welcome back to Artifact Corner. Today, we will be looking at a sword belonging to Frank Hall. Frank Hall was married to Fanny DeLord Webb, and they were the last family members to live in our home. Frank served as a chaplain in the 16th New York State Regiment in the American Civil War. Even though Frank was not a combatant in the conflict, he still had the accoutrements of all of the officers. This sword is a beautiful piece. The grip of the sword is wire-wrapped, and the hilt and guard of the sword are brass and have some lovely pierced filigree. The pierced work has oak leaf scrolls and acanthus leaves. The blade is made from high carbon steel and has an acid etched detail of an eagle on one side and the letters U.S. on the other side. This sword was made by the Ames Manufacturing Company based out of Chicopee, Massachusetts. In the beginning of the Civil War, Ames was granted a contract with the United States government for officer swords. This sword is one of only 575 that Ames made for them. Ames was one of the biggest manufacturers for the Union. They made sidearms, swords, light artillery, and heavy ordnance. The Ames Manufacturing Company was founded in 1832 and continued making metalworks until 1898. Ames is the most highly prized sword company amongst collectors today. Some of Ames' swords are now in major museums such as the Metropolitan Museum of Art. Their work was and is highly regarded, and you can see the quality of this piece 150 plus years later. We are so fortunate to have this sword in our collections. It's beautiful and rare. Thank you so much for stopping by.